YouTube, it's Monique. How are you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Um, today I have my new Erin Condren life planner. Um, I have been getting life planners now for about three years. Um, this is my third year. This is my third life planner. And um, I always order the 12 month planner. So I get the January through December. Um, and um, you're probably asking, well, why did I order my planner now? Well, there, sometimes there's dates that come up, you know, for the new year. Um, my son Malachi, his birthday's in January. Uh, my other son Noah, his birthday's in January. And then my daughter, Yaquara, her birthday is in February. So I do have like pre-planning things, and especially when you are writing dates in for the school year, it's nice to have another planner you know for the next year i do not carry around both planners i just carry around the one planner for the current year and anything that i'm pre-planning or dates that i already have for 2016 i'll write in my new planner so um that is my logic i really do not like the 18th month planners and um i had one to start out with and it was too bulky for me Love the um, 12 months, so that's what works. So that's what I stick with. Anyway, um, here we are with the unboxing. I decided, and I'm trying to cover up my address. I decided to get the horizontal view um, this year. So I wanted to try something different. And in the past, before Erin Contran, that's the kind of planners that I would um, get with a horizontal view. I just really like the style of the Erin Condren planners. And um, so that's why I switched to the vertical. And honestly, like at work, I use Outlook, the Outlook calendars, and they're vertical. So it wasn't hard for me to switch over to that. But now I think I'm gonna get back. At, now I think I'm gonna enjoy getting back into the horizontal view. So this is how it looks when you open it up. And it's a little postcard. This is do of what makes you happy. It's really cute and change without change there would be no butterflies that is cute and of course I got the ready to ship and so this is the card with the little code on it for my free cover and my invoice and now here we are so exciting and of course they bubble wrap it so well and so the adventure begins. How nice. I didn't get any extras, I just ordered the planner. Because, you know, we tend to get a little, I mean, I tend to get a little carried away with extra sometimes and right now I'm not really sure what I want or, you know, anything like that, so. So right off the bat, so funny little dust or whatever here is my they have the ruler with the looks like the party pops design on it it's cute nice sturdy I wonder if it has a little plastic on it I think it does but my nails are not gonna allow me to take it off <laughs> um and so far it's nice well that's really nice I know people were complaining that their planners were not um like laying flat or whatever, but mine seems to be just fine. I'm just kind of checking that out. Yeah, I mean, I do actually have an extra hole punched on this cover, but I don't really care. Um, yeah, how nice is that? Okay. And then you have... Okay, so now we have the front cover. Yeah, well, not the front cover, but the inside. And one of the um, differences here is that you can write your personal information inside the planner instead of putting it inside the front cover, which you are always switching out the covers now. So this kind of makes it a little more permanent. And then there's a quote inside, wherever you go with all your heart. It's nice. And here we have the whole year laid out. And actually this one starts from July 2015 even though this is the hey how about that they sent me an 18 month planner and I did not order an 18 month planner let's just be clear 
Wow. Check that out. Okay, I'm not mad that they did that, but that is hilarious. But just so you guys know, I'm gonna just gonna cover this up so you guys can see how hilarious. Aaron Condren. If you guys can see that, um, I ordered the 12 month. I'm just making sure they didn't charge me for the 18 month because that's not what I ordered. But this is the 18 month. I was thinking this is kind of thick. After I went through that whole thing about how I don't really like the 18 month, I may have to take some of these pages out though because I really, I don't know. I don't know. Let me not get sidetracked with that right now. But anyway, so this is the calendar of the entire 18 months from July 2015 through December 2016 okay and then we have and I've seen this page these two pages in a lot of reviews and it says if you can believe it I can achieve it if I can dream it I can become it so what I'm probably going to use this for is just um some pre-planning in the upcoming months for um 2016 um unless i change my mind which i probably will i don't know well let's see and then we have a notes page here a quote and then the monthly layout what i have noticed that i don't think that anybody mentioned in the monthly layout is um this one has the moons on here so it tells you when the full moon in when the when is the full moon, the half moon, and the new moon. And the other, and the, um, the old Erin Condren life planner, they only did this on the weekly um, spread, not on the monthly one. So that's a difference. And I like that because I actually follow the moons for um, church. So that's great. <clears throat> and we have the goals listed on the side here. And here is the horizontal view, which I am absolutely loving the way it looks. This is really going to be nice. I'm excited. I'm really excited. And I love Skinny Washi, and I think I'll be able to utilize this very well with the Skinny Washi. This is going to be nice. Really going to be nice. So now I'm just flipping through to see if the phases of the moon are still listed on the week spread. And actually it is not, which I don't like. I like that they listed the phases of the moon within the weekly spread because it helped me keep track. So that's a bummer that they took that out. I like it on the month view, but I'd also like it still to carry over to the weekly view. Um, I do like the colors. They're very nice. Um, yeah, and as you can see, they don't cut off the month. They'll run it right into the next, like how this is the end of July, and then it goes right into August, and then we have notes down here. I didn't know if I noticed that before. Oh, okay, I did not notice that. I'm looking at it, you know, for the first time. I didn't notice that. So there is a section to put notes here for the week, and that's great. That is a really good feature. I like that. And I can jot down things I need to remember and um, stuff like that. So that's cool. I really like that in September. Very nice. You know, it's the October. It's the same, you know, little layout. You have your note page, your quote, your monthly layout, and then the weeks begin. I don't know how I feel about having an 18 month um, book and I didn't want one. I really wanted my 12 month because I just find that this is going to get bulky, especially since I'm not going to jump planners. At least I don't think so. But now I'm thinking, I don't know if I should. Oh, the stress, the stress of a planner addict, right? Um... But as I flip through here, it's really pretty. Oh my gosh, I like the new colors. Thing looks really, really nice. Um, let's see what else we can see in here. Actually, let me go to June. I wonder if it has, says anything about 
No, it doesn't. Um, the reason I went to June, I wanted to see if it was going to say anything about the new life plan. Oh, here it is. It's in May. <laughs> Stay tuned for our 2016-2017 life planner launch next month in June. Okay, cool. That's in there. And, um, yeah, that's pretty cool. I like this. Um, I can't wait to start using it, but, you know, I have my restraint. But I have no idea what I'm going to do about that other issue. Anyway, so here are the stickers, the Erin Condren stickers that come in the planner. And we have different colors, and they have a vote sticker for this year. Very cool. I like, I really am digging these new colors. Very pretty. Oh my gosh, very, very pretty. So, um, and then the perpetual calendar the dates in it I you know what to be honest I didn't even use this one last year I don't know um, maybe I'll think of something I have no idea and this is the keep it together folder which seems like it's a little more sturdier than last year's folder definitely a different style and I like it and in the folder in the back the little um, there's some little cards in here and these are nice invite a friend you're gonna give them your referral code um, and then there's just little cards these are cute to put in like a little gift and stuff like that and what they added in here were the dot stickers I remember when these came out earlier this year I know they were a little talk of them being a little off-centered, and actually they are off-centered, which is hilarious. I didn't end up ordering these. I just, I get so many stickers from Etsy and stuff like that, I didn't even bother, because honestly, I just don't need, need any more stickers at this point. But these are cute, and I'm sure I will put them to good use. And they also threw in a coil clip, which I have a bunch of these also, and these are awesome to have um, to clip things into your planner. Now it's like I'm having anxiety because as I say clip things into your planner and this is an 18 month planner, I just don't know. Ay, ay, ay. I don't know if I should email them and say, hey guys, I ordered a 12 month planner and I know that I sound like a pain and is it such a bad thing to get an 18 month planner? Probably not, but I honestly, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, you, I'm sorry guys, you like hearing me rambling and complaining, but this is an unboxing. So this is my, you know, my raw feelings about it. Um, the coil is bigger than last year. Actually, I have my current planner right here so I can show you guys how the coils are. How This is the old coil and this is the new one. And you can see how much bigger it is. And also the this planner is bigger because it's the 18 month and this is the 12 month. Okay. And I still have my spring um, cover on my old planner. But yep. So that's it. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. I'm so glad you were able to join me today for my unboxing of my Erin Conchin Life Planner. See you. Bye bye.